The neuron retreats to the unseeable. We pan out, past the human realm, past the limitations of our perception, to the macro scale. This is planet Earth. 117 billion human brains have lived here since the evolution of Homo sapiens. Eight billion are alive today. If the self arises from 86 billion neurons, none of which are conscious on their own, what might emerge from the combined efforts of all those billions of brains? Slime molds and social insects benefit from swarm intelligence. Elegant, often surprisingly simple rules guide the colony to solve problems that individuals could not. We too demonstrate a swarm intelligence, one more sophisticated than that of insects. We can problem solve as individuals. We can learn from each other and our ancestors. Consider the invention of fire, the spear, the industrial revolution, the internet. Now observe planet Earth from orbit. These satellite images reveal humanity at a scale of individual insignificance. Here we are like an expanding slime mold. Our roadways almost mimic neural pathways. City centers light up like neurons firing. Out of individual insignificance, collective consequences appear. These are satellite images from NASA documenting climate change. Wildfires burn, ice sheets melt, storms overwhelm. This is our planetary brain today. What if in the future, a coherent consciousness emerges from the collective of humanity? Could an individual human mind be an unaware element in a self-aware consciousness? A cumulative consciousness composed of eight billion living minds and the billions that have come before. A mind the scale of a planet with us, the individuals, as unaware as an ant in a colony or as a neuron in a human brain. We have traveled through three scales of the brain, human, micro, and macro. Reality is hallucinated. A neuron fires, 117 billion homo sapiens and counting, until the planet decides our fate. This is scale.